Hi guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. My name is Eno. So in today's video, I'm gonna be doing a quick uh, demonstration on how to configure a static IP address on your uh, Ubuntu desktop machine. So I have a, so I'm already logged into my uh, Ubuntu machine here. In order for you to change the settings, the, the IP address settings, there's an icon up here at the top. It's like a network icon, just click on it. Then go to wired connection, then wired settings. And then in here under wired, there's an, an icon for the settings, uh, click on it. And then right now, as you can see, it shows you what IP address you're using and the default uh, route and the DNS information. You wanna go to IPv4, and as you can see, I'm using DHCP. We'll go ahead and uh, since we're using a static IP, we'll change it to manual. And then right here, you just wanna put the um, the IP you want to use. So I'll put in 172.16.1.22. Uh, the net mask, I'm gonna use 255, 255.255.255.0. The gateway is going to be 172.16.1.4. And then you need to click apply. And then you always want to make sure that this is on right here. And then you can close this out. And then to check the IP, you can also go to the terminal here and type in uh, IP address. And as you can see, still showing the, the, the one it was using before, the one it, it pulled via DHCP. So in order for it to use the one you just changed it to, you need to do a reboot. So I'll go ahead and uh, reboot the device. You can just come up here and do a power off and then just do a restart. Okay, so once the restart is done, you, you, you can log back into the machine. So once you log it back into the machine and you want to check the IP address, uh, there's two ways. You can go to the terminal and do IP address. And as you can see here, let's change the IP to 172.1.16.1.22. Another way you can check it is by going to that icon that we used previously and then going to the uh, wire, under wired connection, go to wired settings. And then in here under wired, click on that settings icon. And as you can see, it shows you the IP address here and the default route and the DNS. So I didn't show to where to put the DNS information. If you go to IPv4, down here you can have, you can put in as uh, many DNS IP addresses as you want. You just add, uh, type in the DNS and then do a comma and then the next one and so forth. This is going to allow you to um, browse um, the internet. So what we can do, we can just check and make sure we have internet access. So I'm up, I'll open the Firefox browser here. And then we'll go to, um, let's go to amazon.com. And as you can see, I'm, I'm able to get into Amazon. So that's it. That's how you set your IP address. That's how you set a static IP address and the DNS information. I hope this information has been useful. I'll see you in my next video. Thanks. Bye.